What's up, family? Today is Memorial Day, a day that we celebrate and commemorate those who have served in the armed forces. Good thing we're not talking about law enforcement because Donald Trump, your president, might have some explaining to do because it was 90 years ago today, on Memorial Day, that Donald Trump's father was arrested at a KKK rally. Yeah, bet y'all didn't know that, huh? Check it out. There were clashes between the Klan and New York City's Catholic police force. A 1927 article stated, Fred Trump of 175 24 Devonshire Road, Jamaica, was discharged, referring to the known address of Fred Trump. Donald Trump's father in the Jamaica neighborhood of Queens. Now, before the rally took place, there was a fly disseminated. And the fly basically let everybody know what the rally was about. It said, native born Protestant Americans were being assaulted by Roman Catholic police of New York City. So basically, the law and order president of today's father took the law into his own hands. Y'all let that simmer for a moment. Now, when confronted with this revelation, this news, this fact, Donald Trump denied the allegations. He said it never happened. Of course he would say it never happened. The dude is a natural born liar. Now, who by a show of hands are really surprised about all of this? Because we know the dude the racist. We know what he's all about. We know how he's built. We know what he's about. Bonafide racist. Uh, have no doubt that Donald Trump's father was a KKK car carrying member. I have no doubt. You know, this is where he come from. This is where he get it. It makes sense because just like Donald Trump was, or pretty much is, his daddy was a slum lord, a racist slum lord back in the 70s. It's reported, it's documented that his daddy had issues where he was being accused of uh, discriminatory practices. So this is not some huge revelation. This is just the past being uncovered. That's all it is. I've been telling y'all all along what this dude is about. I don't know why some of y'all so damn hard-headed. Why y'all want to act like just because a dude have a couple of black folks around him that he not racist or he have a couple of Mexicans around him, he not racist or because he married a, what is his woman? What is his wife? Uh, Slovakian? What is she, Russian or whatever she is, but she, she's an immigrant. Because he married an immigrant, he's not racist. Y'all know, y'all do know that the slave owners slept with the slaves. Y'all know that, right? You know, he, they, and when I say slaves, notice that I wasn't gender specific. I wasn't gender specific. Yeah, slave owners. Y'all want to know where all this homosexuality come from? You can take it right on back over there. Yeah, they were sleeping with boys and girls, women and men. I know that shit hurt, don't it? For you racist trolls out there that's watching me right now, I know I motherfuckers can't stand me, can you? <laughs> but you got to deal with it. You did what I'm saying? Now, according to uh, Ivana, his ex-wife, Donald Trump was obsessed with Hitler and the Nazis. Obsessed. Not a huge surprise that he's kicking it with Russians right now. 
Not a huge surprise. He obsessed with that culture, you know, that mentality. Something wrong with dude. The dude you voted for. Yeah. Now, oh, it also should be mentioned that his granddaddy was a drug selling pimp. Yeah, Donald Trump granddaddy was a pimp. Sold drugs. Bet you didn't know that either, huh? True shell come to light, man. You know what I'm saying? Everything in the dark gonna come to light sooner or later. Believe that. Now, I mean, what a family, man. What a family. What a family. And made it all the way to the White House, which was pretty much consistent with how other presidents from the past, you know, because you know, you had presidents in the past who had who owned slaves. Somehow they figure out a way to name streets and buildings after them and put their name on money like they're somebody to be revered. But, hey, man, you know how I go, man, only in America. But getting back to Donald Trump, Daddy Fred, I'm going to go out on a limb and say, uh, yeah, uh, Fred, maybe he wasn't a KKK member. Maybe he was just... walking around and he happened to stumble upon the KKK meeting while he was out to get milk and some kind of way they arrested him. They made a mistake and arrested him. Yeah. And I'm a World War II veteran who flew 25 combat missions in enemy territory was greatly decorated upon my return to the United States of America, the country that has always honored those of my kind. No more talk. What, what the maid is talking about. Yeah. Order, Texas.